We just paid $1,800 for this abandoned storage unit right here. You know why? Because there are a ton of rare shoe boxes in there and they can be worth thousands of dollars. They could also be completely empty and we could have just lost $2,000. That's how these auctions work. Let's cross our fingers, get digging, and see if we can score. We had to drive over two hours here and I've just been thinking about this moment right now. Let's start with the Kenneth Cole reactions. This will tell us about the rat. Oh, I like the weight of that. My gosh, please be in there. Please, 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 please. No way they're new. No way they're new. <laughs> they're new. We're back at the score. So much money, I can tell you. They're unworn. Brand new. Oh my God, if these are all brand new, this is an insane jackpot right now. This pair is the Kenneth Cole Reaction Desert Sun Suede in dark gray. In retail, they're selling for around 80 bucks new like these are. Kenneth Cole right there. Let's go to the second one. Oh, I love the way that I thought that was a mouse tail. I'm not going to lie. I almost screamed like a five-year-old girl. Let's see. Yes, look at that. Brand spanking new. Oh, thank you. Just like before, these are the same ones. Kenneth Cole Reaction, Desert Sun Suede in just a different color, but pricing about the same thing, another $80. Thank you. That's all I can say right now. I've been so scared about this. Remember, remember my limit on this unit was $800, and I bid $1,600 because something in my gut, my brain was like, this is stupid. Stop, stop, stop. Something in my gut was like, go for it, go for it, go for it. I listened to it. Look at this. Are these new? Well, that's empty. These are... Brand new Hanes t-shirts with a pocket in, bo in bag still. Brand new socks, or no, tank tops right there. I'm liking what I see already. This right here though, I'm liking most of what I see. What in the heck is this? Uh, uh, I don't know. This looks like something you find in like a Frankenstein castle or something, like a human brain that's slowly dissolved in acid maybe. I know one thing about it though. <laughs> it's not going to my truck. <laughs> I know that. Cider. Oh, look at this. They didn't even take a picture of this. Why? Ah, money. There's just like, I mean, there's a lot of quarters in there actually. I bet you that's 10 or 15 bucks. This probably would have made people bid an extra 500 because that's how it works. <laughs> you see 15 bucks, you bid 500. That's the storage game right now. That's a good sign. Are those pickles too? Pickles, your favorite. Why? I hate pickles. Let's pull this out. This is what almost drove me away from the unit. Usually if I see food, I run the other direction really fast because two things, one, mice. Two, that usually can mean somebody's homeless, so you never really know. But I've been to this facility before, it's nice. I've never seen mice before, or bugs, so I went for it. What is this right here? There's bathroom stuff, more bathroom stuff. Yeah, this right here, it's a bunch of garbage. Man, it's 94 degrees right now and I'm feeling it in here. Oh my gosh, this might be all brand new jeans. I see tags on these jeans. Oh, PlayStation. Oh, okay, okay, with more food. Ooh. Let's go here first. Are these brand new? Look at that. Brand new Levi's. 25 bucks right there. That's good. What else is in there? Come on, are these all new clothes too? I'm gonna pull out one more pair. Look at that. Bang. Brand new with tags. Tags, $58 right there for these pants. Brand spanking new. I'm having such a good time already. Let's see, is the PlayStation in there? That definitely feels right. Let's see, this is the PlayStation 1 Classic. Has a bunch of, you know, like the most popular older games you can plug it into a modern TV via HDMI now. This is the Classic, right? Yeah. I'm not talking out of my booty hole, right? <laughs> no, okay. you read the box. I didn't. Oh, look at that. Oh, look how it's cute. It's brand new. <laughs> brand new PlayStation. This is like 50 or 60 bucks too. I'm gonna lose five pounds today. That's another benefit. But I was going through this food box to get the food out and I found this sock, listen. I don't know what's in there. There's stuff also, coming out of it. Ew, what is that? I'm gonna guess because it's powder, so it's either something I don't wanna mess with or food of some sort. I'm just gonna leave it right there. And we also got this nice LG phone. It's actually not cracked, I guess, because it's not Apple. That's a good find too. You hear the fighter jets? I hear the fighter jets. We're right by the Naval Station. That's a good find too. But I know what's funny. I don't think a lot of people notice this except for one other guy. Those shoes right there, if you look at them at first glance, what are you gonna think? They're Nerf guns, right? They're not. They're all expensive like collab shoes, Nerf with Reebok and other things like that. The bid of this unit was at 260 until the last five minutes. Then it went to 16 something. One other person out there saw what I saw and I don't like you this <laughs> day right now because I would have got it for a few hundred bucks. These just pre-owned clothes. That'll be donation right there in that. What's in here? <clears throat> I see an inhaler and some spice. What? I said it's a spice. Is this a wallet? No, it's a power bank. Yeah, we, we, this is garbage. 
I know what you're thinking. Why am I excited about making $340 and I spent almost $2,000 on the unit? That's because this is only the tip of the iceberg. This unit is about to pump out money. That was fake money. Let's go to this box right here and I'm loving what I'm seeing right off the bat. These are brand new too. Look at those bottoms. Yep. Never used right there. How many pairs? Man, those fighter jets. I know. You hear that? Yeah. We're like, I feel like I'm at war right now, <laughs> but brand spanking new, unused shoes right there. One, two, three, four pairs, brand new shoes in that. Are we, are we getting attacked? Might be. <laughs> I hope not. Let's go to this guy right here. I want to see what's in this one. If you can hear me over these. Thank you, thank you, thank you, baby. Thank you, thank you. Okay, now that the planes are gone, this box? Oh yes, hey. Xbox. Nice. Saints Row for 360, LA Noir, Xbox 360, 360 controller, 360 Connect. You know, I've never seen a white one before. It's kind of weird. An Xbox 360 Connect controller, a few games, probably 30, 40 bucks right there, easy. Hey, you want those Mount Olive pickles right there? I don't. Oh, come on. I know you do, though. I don't even like pickles on my sandwich. I don't like pickles at all. Let's see what's in this box right here. Are these shoes, they look like mold on them, but it doesn't smell like mold. I don't really know what happened to those. Usually, like, it's pretty obvious when, you know, something's moldy, but that has no mold smell. I'm just going to set those right there. Uh, I guess this box right here. Sure. Uh, then after this, I got to grab one of the expensive boxes. Just one. Just one. What's in here? Clothes galore. These, oh my God. New. These are all new. Quarter boy. Levi's. <laughs> what about this? Is this new? This doesn't look new. No. Uh, no. I don't see a tag. No. What about so just the pants new? No, these ones aren't new, are they? No. No. So it's kind of a mix in here. It looks like. Look, here's some Ralph Lauren polos that are brand new in the bag still. There goes another Ralph Lauren polo, brand new in the bag. Uh, another one. Uh, no, that one's a different brand, but again, brand new in the bag. I'm wondering where somebody gets this much new stuff from and just stores it and why. These are $89 pants that are just in a storage unit, brand new. Clothes, but again, a couple more brand new. Guaranteed is like $150 in new clothes in that box. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this one right here. Yay! You better leave the video a thumbs up right now because this is really the defining moment on if we're gonna get screwed or we're gonna make big money. I like the weight of this box, oh my God. If these are like new or even slightly used, this is gonna be a massive score. I don't wanna destroy the box because these boxes. <laughs> Look at the are box like design. Like this looks so dirty, actually. It does. But let's see. This is the moment right here. The moment I've been thinking about for two hours. I drive recognize here. this. What? Jurassic Park. Oh, that's what it's from? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's when he had the little thing that, oh yeah, from God. the lab in there. It still has styrofoam. Please, 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 please. Oh my God, they're Whoa. new. <laughs> they're new, no way. Oh my God, look at that. Wow. Brand new. Now, I don't even think they've been taken out of the box. Wow. Look at that. That, oh my God, if those are all brand new. God. Sometimes you just gotta listen to your gut and ignore the logic, because that is exactly what I did today. And I think it's about to pay off huge. These beauties were released July 30th, 2021 by Reebok, and of course are paying homage to the film Jurassic Park. Drum roll please, these things are currently selling for $280 right now, and they're likely to go up a whole lot in the future as they become more retro. Let's try to clear some of this stuff out the way so we can get this table out the way, then that can become mm. my table. This is a military bag. It is, uh, it doesn't have a name on it. It says Looney. I don't think that's somebody's last name. You're like Looney Tunes spelled like that. Yeah. I don't think that's somebody's last name. Maybe that's just a nickname. Let's get this out real quick. Anything in here? That does not smell good. In here smells a little moldy. So I'm gonna guess, yeah, whatever's in here is gonna go from here to the garbage. What is this, a speaker? A speaker. A speaker, but it does kind of smell on a check. Cool. A check for 800 bucks and Woo! it has the guy's name on it. Now I could look this dude up and see what happened to lose a unit like this. If you're weird and nosy and you wanna know why this guy lost his unit, then shame on you. No, I'm just kidding, I'm exactly that way too. Come to find out, I did a background check on the guy. Multiple drug possession charges last year and multiple what's intent to distribute charges with the latest being February of this year. Do the math, end of February, add three months. If you don't pay your storage bill for three months, they put it up for auction. Three months at the end of February makes it about June, right about now. Dude's probably in jail right now, maybe watching us on a little iPad like, man, 
Man, that guy got all my shoes, but hey, don't break the law. And this unit's only about to get a lot better. Just wait. Now we're gonna pull out this Unity strut assembly box. And there's our guy's name again. That's the same name on the check, so I know for sure whose unit this is. I don't even know what this company does, but we're about to find out what's in the box right now. Unity strut assembly. Yeah, that means like nothing. It basically might as well be a foreign language. Right. Okay, let's see. Come on. I'm gonna guess something to do with clothes based on what else we found. No way, what are what these? What What is this? Still nothing, it says ready to install. What is it? For truck. High quality, what? For a truck? Look right here. High quality, ready to install. Complete strut assembly. Okay, okay. But I don't really wanna open it because it's sealed. You know what, we'll just cut the chain because I wanna see. But it's brand new, whatever it is. It's Box. A car. Yeah. Definitely something to do with the car, huh? Hopefully, that's worth some money right there. Still don't know exactly what this thing is, but I punched it into eBay, sold listings brand new like this, and they seem to be going for $100 to $200, depending on the model. This box we found looked exactly like ours for $150, bucks, and it was the cheapest one I saw, so hey, I'm calling it $150. While I'm back here, we might as well go ahead and pull out the Transformer box. Another shoe! And it feels right. I think we did so good right now. Whoa. Transformers, that's sick, actually. Robots in disguise. They Wait, look cool. These are numbers. Oh, so it's like a whole collection of built This is like number six in the set, I guess. Okay. That's kind of cool. Whoa. Whoa. Man. Cool. Look at those. Uh, I think yeah, they've probably been worn a little bit, but I mean, I think really. 30 seconds with an alcohol pad, these are brand new. Like, I think he might have tried these on and put them back on the box. That's my guess right here. That is sick right there. That is really Transformer cool. Transformer shoes. <laughs> what in the heck? It's crazy. Turns out I'm just a little bit of an idiot. They're not actually Transformers. They're Power Rangers that did a collab with Reeboks to make these shoes. There's a bunch of different ones that come together and make one big guy, but this one box in particular is going for about 130 bucks, so absolutely not bad. Set them right there. See, Reeboks are doing all these like collaborations. Where's Jordan's collab? What about, should I try this one? Sure. Oh. See, this is all you could see in the picture. This is why I was hoping it would go low because everyone's gonna think it's just Nerf stuff and Nerf stuff's not expensive. But if you know how to, you know, reverse image search on Google, you would quickly find out that they're shoes and rare, pretty expensive ones. And it does feel right. <laughs> are they new? Whoa. Oh my Whoa, God, look at that. Are. Brand new. Nerf. Nice. That's sick. And the tag. Brand new with the tag never open. This was another collab done with Reebok in 2021. The vintage 90s looking Nerf brought back a lot of memories being a 90s baby myself. These shoes are absolutely beautiful and as you can see right now, completely brand new, never worn, never even tried on, I don't think, and actively selling for $200. Brand new in box just like that. What a score. I have a feeling Today is about to be a very good day. You know what's crazy? Huh. I had another unit on my watch list. I've been watching for a week. It canceled 30 minutes before I went off and I was like, I don't want to sit at home today. So I started looking for other units. Saw this one, went for it. Isn't it funny how things work sometimes? Yeah. What do you want? Another pair of shoes or do we go back to this side? Go to this side and then we'll go get shoes. Okay. We just okay. opened what? Two pair of shoes. So. <laughs> I'm so happy right now. I want to keep the excitement. Can I go just give you a high five, please? Give me a hand. Thank you. And Gosh. them, give them one. Boom! Hey. Oh, we took a risk. Sometimes you gotta take a risk. These are all closed. There's something brand new in here. More. Look, Levi's, brand spanking new in the bag. A lot of these are not new, unfortunately. Huh? No. Oh my gosh, these fighter jets. Oh, uh, look over here. Nah, most of this right here, 90%. Hey, look, a quarter. I got more money. Hey. But I'd say 90% of these are pre-owned and pre-owned clothes, unless it's like designer. We usually just donate. I know I said I was gonna go to the shoes next, but I see cases in here and I wanna make sure this box isn't full of video games because if it is, my boot's gonna get even higher. Oh no, it's, oh, it's both. Oh, both. It's both. I was about to say just uh, DVDs, Madden 16. That's nice in there. Oh, look at this, an Uncharted PS3 double pack. That's sick. What else? What other games do we have in here? That's the questions. Uncharted 3. Oh, you see it? Hey, Uncharted 3, dude's an Uncharted fan. Good series. What is this one? Oh, The Evil Within 2. Never played that game. But a lot of these are DVDs. The DVDs, we lot up. We usually get around a buck or so a piece. Not too expensive. But video games, I'm always happy to find. What do you think? The cool looking box or the Nike box? Nike. Where do I go? Nike. Let's try Nike. Let's see what these... Oh, no. No. Our first L. Oh, boo. Oh, come on. Okay, you know what? We're, we're not going to take that like that. Get this box out of here. 
What about the candy land? Candy land? Yes, that feeling is right. These are the expensive ones anyway. These Reeboks, new. Oh, oh my whoa, God. those are nice. Something tells me these aren't getting sold, are they? They're no. going to your collection, aren't they? No. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I would do the same thing if it was something I wanted. So. Those are cool. Brand new with tags again. Oh my God. That wow. is so sick right there. The childhood nostalgia with these Candyland shoes is unreal. I used to love this game as a kid. Again, these are another collab that was done with Reebok. Absolutely beautiful shoes, beautiful box, completely brand new, actively selling for around $150 plus. So I just picked up this bag right here because I want to see what's in there. I see jeans, but are they new? Oh yes, they are. 50 bucks right there on these. Oh my God, there's like, freaking a lot in here aren't there there's one one two these are the same three about four pairs of jeans in here all new with tags what look at this 46 dollars right there these guys right here i don't see there's their tag right there uh 50 dollars then these ones right here we just saw i think no those are only 17 mm -hmm. but still that's probably a 100 bucks in retail and jeans right there I'm curious to go into the tote bag now. All right, let's go let's in the tote see bag. Then. What's in the tote bag is I see cases, ooh, DVDs, but that doesn't mean there's no more video games buried in there. Well, the last time they were mixed. Yeah, they were. But this one, oh, I see blue. Ah, blue, blue, right, dang it. Thought it was a PlayStation. No, these are all DVDs though, but still, like I said, we get 50 cents to a dollar a piece. Easy, minimum 20 bucks in that bag. Let's go to this box now. Oh, oh I thought hey, it was, hey, box. a Nike box. I thought it was a lot bigger than a box than this. But let's see, let's get this hoodie off. Oh, I see a Bible in a tablet. We always get told there's money in Bibles and I've been buying storage units for over five years and I've never found a dollar inside of a Bible. And today's not my day either. Nope. That's all right. We donate the Bibles too, just because. Give them to somebody to make a dollar. There's a tablet, it's broken. Uh, books, there's a little knife and some matches, but nothing too valuable in there. This string and me are really about to have beef right now. <laughs> we got a pillow here. Let's see, this Nike box good? Let's see. Oh no, that's way too heavy to be shoes. I don't know what these There's are. There's money in there. I see a dime. What is this? <laughs> ew. 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 What did you do in there? What were you doing? Yeah. <laughs> that's the clean ones, the yard sale. The dirty ones is not worth saving to the dump. All right. This tote right here looks like, uh, do we even go in here in detail? No. Oh, little airway thingy. And yeah, unfortunately used clothes, which again, I'd rather just donate and try to make a buck or two. I think we've been patient. I think we get another shoe. Yay! Jurassic Park. And I love the weight of them. Let's freaking go. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yes. Man. I'm trying to yes. make sure we don't damage the boxes. <laughs> oh yeah, brand new. Nice. Literally brand new attacks. Just come out. Yeah, look at that. That's crazy how they just have all these chilling in there, brand spanking new. <laughs> Look at that. That's Still insane. has the tag, never worn, 100%. That is a sick find. This is yet another Reebok collab with Jurassic Park and these shoes look absolutely sick. Brand new, unworn, still in the box with a box in good shape, selling for around $190 on eBay right now. But again, I think they're gonna go up significantly in the years coming. Tell me why the ceiling looks like ground hamburger, doesn't it? <laughs> like it looks like taco meat, man. Every time I look up, I'm just like, ew. Like when I say taco meat, it makes me hungry, but then I look at that and it doesn't. Yeah, no. <laughs> okay, let's go through this thing right here. Uh, jeans, what is what that? that? Oh, oh, what'd you think it was? I thought it was a safe. Oh, man, that, that. <gasps> Leave some air for the rest of us. Sorry. <laughs> uh, these are all use close from what i was saying so again we'll just donate this stuff unity strut assembly boxes right there i still at this point don't know what they are you probably do already because i've edited at this point you're watching so <laughs> we got us a dvd player and i like what i just saw pop out i think these are brand new feelers oh oh nice crispy clean look at that unworn before brand new with tag why does somebody buy this many shoes and store them and then not be able to, like you waste all your money buying the shoes and you can't even afford to keep them i just don't understand the logic but you know works for us let's dig through this tote right here to see if we see anything of interest well that was just the top to a trash can that fell these look like a lot of used clothes used clothes all right can i say before we cover it up completely this side open that crown royal bag where Ooh. the green one oh. 
empty. Aww. Dang it. What else? Anything else? No, this one's all again closed and we'll just donate. Let's go to this thing underneath of it so I can get this table out. Ooh, I'm pretty sure I see PlayStation cases. <laughs> get out, get out, get out. And food. <laughs> oh, lovely. I'm going to put it right here on my table. Right here. We got <laughs> ink card Skittles. Yay. Ooh, we have a. Ooh, 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 ooh. With 100 bucks. Bang. Oh, no money in there. But we got Skittles. I do have control our games. Batman for PS4, Mana for PS3, Uncharted for PS4. Right here we have NCAA. Hey, I think NCAA 14 is the one that's worth money. One of these are worth like 50 bucks, and I forget which one it is. I want to say it's 14, but I could be completely wrong. I was right about the game being the expensive one, but I was wrong about it being $50. It's actually selling for $85. Score! Uh, let's see. What else is down here? What is this? Ooh, the Dark Knight series. That's nice. What else is over here? Controller, something right there. Yeah, I thought it was a calculator. It looks like, what is that? Power bank maybe? Maybe. That, and over here on this side, not seeing much of it. Hey, that's what it goes to. It's a little mini Sega Genesis right there. That's pretty cool too. This box here says it's a Dutch oven. I, I mean, maybe I'm just very uncultured. I only know one meaning for that and it's not this. But look inside, it's not that at all. It's a bunch of DVDs, uh, some like VHSs maybe? <laughs> that, whatever those are. But a bunch of just random DVDs and not what it says it is at all. Another pair of shoes. Yay. It's got the good kind of weight again. See, if you saw these stack like this, would you ever in a million years think these are shoes? Because you probably think they're Nerf. Nope. I mean, I honestly thought they were Nerf. You're the one that told me they look like shoe boxes. <laughs> I can't even lie. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Crispy, fresh. Oh. Look at that. I like those. These look like Nickelodeon. <laughs> no, that know. reminds me of like the 90s Nickelodeon, the green slime and the orange yes. logo. Oh my gosh. Those are so nice. Mm, brand spanking. I can't believe. Those are really cool. These are all brand new I right know. now. Like, I'm awesome. just mind blown right now. Probably my favorite pair of shoes of the unit so far. Again, these are Reeboks. They did a collab with Nerf, but to me, it just looks like that vintage 90s Nickelodeon logo with the slime and the orange. Absolute beautiful pair of shoes. They're selling for closer to $300. Some are listed for two something. Some sold for 300 best offers, so we don't really know. I'm going to guess around $250 for these beauties i got a table you want a table <laughs> well i don't need one okay i'll set it right here but i appreciate the offer i mean i'm just trying to be nice watch your offer table <laughs> no, return the slot you know if you know the reference put it in the comments right now because if you do we can be best friends let's go into this one right here ah. oh it almost got my foot this one right here doesn't look like it's anything. These look like tissues, curtains. Yeah, this one, another check. Why does this dude have so many random checks? And they're all, this is the fourth one that's exactly $861.81. Why? That's just so strange. I'm telling you, I'm at least five pounds lighter already. That's great. Unity, front assembly again. That's great. It is. <laughs> again, hey, brand spanking new. Thank you very much. Right there. What about this cat coal? Oh, it feels like I want it to feel. It feels like it's got brand new shoes in it. Yes, it does. Look at that. Nice. Brand new kind of coal again. You like our pile of new shoes right here? It's getting I do. really tall really quick. Just like before, these Kenneth Coles absolutely brand new and selling for around $80. Because all you guys watching the videos have been so great so far, I think we've earned the right to do two boxes. Ooh. Yeah, we're, we're doing it this time. And I like, I like the feel of both of them. All right. Let's go Nike first. Wham. Ooh. Crispy fresh airs. Oh, I have those. <laughs> I was about to say, I know you have these. Brand new. Nice. Look at that. It still has the cardboard in it and everything. Weren't these like well over a hundred bucks? Yeah. Man. Nice. This is so sick. <laughs> these Nike Air More Up Tempo Bulls, Varsity Red and White are brand new in box and currently selling for around 180 bucks and some selling well over 200 depending on size. <laughs> Gosh, I'm like always preaching, trust your brain over your feelings. <laughs> Don't listen to your feelings, listen to your brain. I trusted my feelings today <laughs> and I'm making a lot of money because of it. <laughs> Let's see what's in here right now. Tell me, I think we got an idea. These are so fresh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Nice. Nice and clean with all the tags. Brand spanking new. 95 on the back. Are these like 90 themed? Yeah. Is there a 94? I mean, they definitely look like yeah, it. Yeah, no, that's what I, as soon as I saw the boxes, I was like, that brought me back. They have a 94. That'd be cool. That's, the, you know, I've heard that that's kind of the year of the legend. 
Another beautiful pair of shoes from the Nerf Reebok collab. Again, brand new inbox, never worn, never taken out, I don't think, and selling for around $150 on eBay. Before I grab the last shoe box in this stack, I wanna get this and, oh, <laughs> there's more. Oh my gosh. That, go, that might That's go all the way back. That's at least two stacks right there. Oh. oh my gosh, that might go all the way to the wall. Stack. Let's look in here really quick. Come on, no To the books. window. To the wall. <laughs> Till money drops down my head. This is YouTube. <laughs> There's a bunch of cassettes in here. These little things again. Whatever they are, not really sure, but I don't think they're gonna be worth anything. Do it, one box or two? Two. One or two? All two. right. I believe in you. Oh, that's got the good weight. So is the feel. Ah! Yay! I feel like, uh, I, I don't even know what I feel like. <laughs> look at those. Uh, Yee. These are the first ones that look kind of bad. Yee. They just, they look moldy, but I don't think you ever wore them though. You know no. what I mean? Yeah, they look new, but. I think they just got moldy. So that one's probably garbage, unfortunately. Turns out it wasn't mold. It was just dust probably from being in storage that came right off with a paper towel and now they look fresh again. These aren't as expensive as the rest, only selling for between 50 and $80 on eBay. This one? Oh no, those are nice and fresh. They're kind of ugly though, I can't lie. I don't think they're ugly. You don't think so? I do not. Uh, I mean, they're not my personal favorite, but. <laughs> I think That's they look fair. pretty good. The bottoms look clean. It just got a little stuff in there mm -hmm. from probably being stored again. Alcohol wipe in 10 seconds. They're fresh and brand new. Again, these Nikes only had some dust on them probably from being in storage for so long, but 10 seconds of the paper towel, they looked brand new again, and they're selling for around $80 on eBay, so not bad. I wonder why it looked like I'm dying. I just looked it up. It was 94 degrees. Now it feels like 97 according to the weather app, and there's no AC going in this thing, but <sighs> it's all right. Let's go to the next thing right here and pull it out. Yeah. Looks like, again, this is all going to be used clothes. I think, oh, I see a tag, but it's not attached to nothing. All used, oh my God. Look. Whoa. Whoa. No way. This looks like it's all used clothes, but that right there looks like a lot of freaking cash. Let's kind of look in this box here, actually. Brand new, brand new, brand new. Did I mention brand new about, oh, look, Jurassic Park. Look at that. Nice. $80 price tag on it, too. No telling how old it is. Could be worth more than that. Another one. Oh, look, three of them. Another one's right here. <laughs> That's a lot of brand new clothes right there. Easily probably another hundred bucks. We got us a couple DVDs. A uh, little tiny uh, flat screen TV or computer monitor maybe. We'll set that right here because I want to get this last table out so we can see what we have back here. Oh, I see lots of shoes is what I see. Ugh. What is this right here? You uncovered two more Nike boxes right there. That's what I like to miss. See? Uh, oh, a phone box. Uh, it doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel good. I'm not going to lie to you. Come on. <laughs> no, nah, it's not in there. Anything interesting in here, though? What is this chrome thing? Uh, what is that? A chrome? Hey! A dollar. A dollar. I'll take that. But, Pretty faded. Huh? Pretty faded. It is. A, another one of these Celtronics things. Another check. What do you want to think it's for? Oh, no. This one's for nine something. But it's <laughs> the same dude. I don't really know what this chrome thing is. It's the laptop. Oh, it is. Oh. Ew. Seen Fresh. better days, though. Seen better days. I don't think there's gonna be anything in this thing right here that's worth a whole lot of money, unfortunately. I just pulled this box out of that thingy right there. So let's see what's inside of here. Come on, new, 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 new. Uh, definitely close. Ooh, and definitely new. What's the price tag on that? $42 for that pair right there. These, looks like a Where's Waldo type shirt. And what about the jeans? Are these new? No, some of these are, that's not what this obviously is. $42, $42, two pairs right there. Easily close to a hundred bucks retail or over a hundred bucks retail again. Now let's take the whole container out. And that's our dude's name again on this, by the way. I don't want you to see that. But all the names and addresses match, so we know whose unit we got. That's empty. What about this right here? These look like used clothes. Again, this stuff will just be donated. Let's go two boxes again. Yay. Let's see if we got more candy land. Look at all these Nike boxes too, man. These feel right too. Let's check Nike first. Mm -hmm. I like what I see. Ooh, crispy fresh. Great. Look at that. Eh, they've been worn, but not much, not much at all. Just a little bit of dirty. Again, these are some Air Forces. Give them a little bit of an air uh, alcohol pad. They'll be brand new and fresh. <laughs> these shoes are what are called Nike ID shoes, which means somebody went online and customized and picked their own colors. So they're not like a shoe that's out there in the open. Now I looked up Nike ID shoes on eBay and the prices are all over the place. Some of them selling for as low as 40 bucks and some of them selling for over $200 with the average being about 70 bucks for the custom air force ones like these so we're gonna go with 70 bucks this right here another candy land uh, oh what the heck is this a shirt that goes with it 
Look at that. Nice, crispy, beautiful, fresh shoes. Look well, at the like top. I know, it? that's so freaking cool right there. Money for days. These are yet again another pair of Reebok shoes when they did a collab with Candyland. Just like the other ones, they're brand new. There's no sign of them ever being worn and they're selling for around $190 on eBay. Let's go to this box and oh my, look at all these right there. If that was visible, this would have sold for the $2,000 on wow. its own. Not even including everything we pulled out already. I see more Ralph Lauren. Dude's address again. What's, what's in there? I want to see. Uh, and so it's somebody's like funeral paper. So we'll make sure they get that back right there. But brand new Ralph Lauren, brand new pirate shirt, uh, dress clothes. The rest of it, it's weird that it's like such a mix of what's new and pre-owned, but everything else in here looks pre-owned, so the rest of it's just donation. We earned the right to do three yet. Did, uh, did we do that? Yes. Okay, you know what, we're gonna do three. Let's take this one. I like the feel of it. And, oh, this feels like three new pairs of shoes to me. <laughs> what's in here? Turn around, bam. Oh, oh, whoa, I really like these. I so wish these were size 15. You know what I noticed though? What? About these Nike boxes? Look at that one. But, like oh, the colors labeled. on there and then this one says venom okay so i wonder if they're like you know themed? yeah themed shoes this is another pair of custom made nike id air force ones and again the prices are all over the place so it really just comes down to how bad somebody wants the color combination anywhere from 50 bucks to 200 plus let's call it 70 again i don't know that's cool though all right what about this one air max oh again they put a shirt with it but Ooh, look, ew, ew, <laughs> ew. I nope. don't, I don't like yellow. No, I don't like yellow. But I mean, they're in really good nice. shape. Yeah. yeah, for somebody. They're out there, somebody out there is gonna appreciate them. Even though I think they're butt ugly, they're called Nike Air Max 95 NYC Taxi. And believe it or not, even pre-owned on eBay, they're selling for 180 bucks. I can't tell if ours are brand new or worn maybe once, but either which way, 180 bucks. Then the bottom mm -hmm. box is the Fila. Hopefully these ones aren't moldy like the other pair was. No, a little, is that mold? Can't tell. Cause it does like, usually I find, I find moldy stuff. We buy storage units all the time. Usually when you have like the smallest bit of mold, that smell is just overwhelming. And I don't smell anything from these boxes. So maybe it's just dirty. If it's mold, obviously they'll go in the garbage, but if not, they're money. Another pair that cleaned up perfectly fine with a paper towel, no mold, just dust. Another $50 to add to the pile. Three up, three more to go. These ones I think are all Nike. Okay. Are you ready for some color comments? Those are all labeled too. Are they? Yeah. Ooh, another sexy pair of Nike ID shoes again, custom colors. So we're calling them seventy bucks. Cool. Mm, that looks kind of ugly. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I mean, they're in Burn really good shape. Gold. Yeah, they're in good shape. They look dirty, like this looks dirty because of the colors, but they're actually in like really good shape. Once again, Nike ID, super clean, really fresh, probably never worn. Another seventy dollars, at least, probably more. All right. What about this pair here? Up here. Kabang. That, ew, that's like Redskins colors, but that's definitely got something on it too. But again, like there's no smell of mold at all. So I don't think it's mold. I really, whatever it is, they'll probably come right off. Same story as many of the other shoes. Absolutely no mold, just dust, came right off with a paper towel, minty fresh condition, easily $70. But again, probably more. We've been pulling out a lot of the black boxes. Let's go to some of the red Nike boxes here, right here. This one's got some cobwebs on it, but you know, it's been in storage for who knows how long. Oh, got a tee with it again. <laughs> I like how they put Ooh, a t-shirt with it. <laughs> I know, look at that though, that's nice. nice. And it's just a plain red Nike tee. It's brand new as well, by the way. <laughs> 25 bucks on that guy. These red Nikes are called Nike Air Vapor Max Plus Triple Red. And again, ours are brand new and selling for well over $100. And then underneath of it we have, mm, is that the same pair? No, no, they're both red though. <clears throat> I mean, I didn't really expect the red shoes to be in both the red boxes. I was just saying red boxes, but hey, we'll take red shoes too. These are the Nike Air Max 90 City Special Chicago and ours are brand new and the brand new pair is selling for $140 on eBay. What is this box right here? I don't know. I, I don't know either. We'll have to find out. Oh, they are shoes actually. I didn't think they would be. They look like more dress shoes though, but they're brand new. Again, it's got the little stick in them to make sure they don't bend too. All right, we'll set that pair right there. Let's just grab another red Nike box. Sure. Let's grab the other red Nike box. Ew, this is, ew, that's toilet paper. So we're not gonna mess with that. All right. This right here, bang. There's a T with it. And ooh. Nice. Beautifully fresh, even though they look kind of gross because they look like eagle colors and the eagles are disgusting, but you know what? <laughs> Somebody out there will buy, what's the shirt on it actually? 
Just another Nike. brand new Nike shirt to go with it. These Nikes are completely brand new, never worn. I don't even think ever tried on. They're called Nike Air Vapor Max Plus Atlanta, and they're pretty expensive, $175 on eBay. These are AKA Demics, whatever that means. Academics. Oh, look at that, I can't read. Academics, there they are, and there again. Did I say this yet? No. What about these Nikes right here? Bang. Oh, I, nice. I like that color right there. <laughs> Those are sick, yeah. Another super clean pair of custom Nike Air Force Ones. We're gonna call them 70 bucks again. Yeah, so, that's good. Another pair of Nikes here. Bang. Ooh, these are my color combo right here. I love <laughs> red and black. That's like my favorite color combination there is. Look how clean those custom Air Force Ones are. Another $70 plus. Red and black. Converse right here. Boom, look at that. Another brand new pair of shoes. Unfortunately, Converse isn't as expensive, but still about 30 to 40 bucks. Let's call them 40. Beauties. Fucking yellow. Hey, you know what it is. Belas. Oh, those are used, but still not bad. Nikes right here. Ooh, those are red again. He really liked red, didn't he? Mm -hmm. Some nice and red. All of these Nike ID ones have that like um, sparkle at the uh, sparkle, yeah. like this design at the bottom. It looks nice. Yet another pair of beautiful untouched red custom Nike ID Air Force One, seventy dollars. Feel that right here. Oh look, is that the receipt? No, it doesn't say. It has his name on it. It doesn't say what he paid for him. But hey, these ones are actually in good shape. Nothing on them. Nike right here. Bang. I really like that color combo. Yeah. No idea. What about these right here? Bang! Oh, look at that. This looks like Superman or something. Interesting. Yeah. That's cool. What does it say on the side? Kansas. Kansas. Oh, Kansas, maybe. I don't know. Please don't tell me I'm the only one that thinks of Superman when I see these shoes. But again, custom, super nice condition, Air Force One, $70. That, these, black and gold. Absolutely gorgeous and pristine. These, uh, what do we got? Oh, that looks kind of cool too. A little dirty. McDonald's. Also. McDonald's color. That's what I thought of too. <laughs> I don't want to sound fat. <laughs> okay, let's be real here. Who doesn't need McDonald's Air Force Ones in their life? There's some Converse right there. And we got two more Nike boxes down here. Oops. Bang. That's decent. That's nice. decent. Not my favorite color combination, but still in perfect shape. And then the last ones all the way over here are... Oh, my favorite one of the whole storage units so far, to be honest with you. If these things were size 15, they would 100% be in my closet right now. And this giant pile of money right here is what we're left with. Over 30 pairs of shoes in box, pretty much all new or worn maybe once. If you made it to the end of the video, leave a comment saying this storage unit's a jackpot. And until next time, make sure you subscribe for more storage unit adventures. Peace out.